Aries, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. My name's Jen Dawson, welcome to Gen TV. Aries, I'm a little bit cranky today. I'm a little bit grumpy. iPhones do this thing where they remind you of a photo every day. Um, if you sort of swipe one way, it reminds you of a photo. I've been in a really good place. I've been in a great place. I've been tired, but you know, healing, I'm in a good place. I posted up a picture of my twin flame. No. I got angry. So the universe and I have had words. That was not fair. No, it's a bit of a low blow from the universe. So let's do this for you. Low blows. What's what's your low blow and how can we uh how can we help you here, Aries? Low blow for Aries. Bear in mind, my loves, these are general readings, so it's not going to resonate with all of you. But if it does, take a look at the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. I'm not doing private readings at this time, especially when I'm this cranky. Ooh, I feel in a filthy mood now. Ooh. Low blow for Aries. Me and the universe had words, let me tell you. I actually have to say I've never read before with this energy. I've never done a reading where I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm fuming. I'm livid. So the overall vibe for you, what's your low blow? We've had the page of wands. What's the overall vibe and the cause of it? Is the nine of pentacles. Like what? Pages are kind of cute. They're, you know, it's 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 a it's a, it's a it's a gentle energy, an explorative energy, if you will. It's like let's see what's out there in the world. The door isn't open this time, and I'll tell you why. Because I've literally just let him out before I started the video. He's like, oh, I want to go out. Now he wants to come back in. You'll just have to wait, darling. I pander to him. Anyway, so the overall vibe, we've got the page of wands. This is like a lovely little exuberant energy. An explorative energy. Let's see what's out there. Let's, you know, it's... Maybe a little naive. But, you know, it's it's getting out there and, and discovering the world and love and life. And this isn't a bad card. The cause of it, the Nine of Pentacles. This is about stability, security, not needing someone else. That's it. That's it. That's the energy I've been in for a while now. I don't need anyone else, but I'm, I'm willing to get out there and see what there is. You know, dating. This is what's going on for you. You, I get it. It resonates with me. You've been out there. You've been dating. You've been looking and you're all right. You're a stable, secure, independent person. Don't need nobody, but hey, you go look. So what you need to know right now is the Queen of Cups. You're good. You're in an emotional, secure, calm, relaxed place. So where's the low blow coming from? Oh, I, I see it. Tell me more about the Queen of Cups for what you need to know right now. This is still great. 
this is still fine. What you need to know right now, it's all good. Got the Ace of Cups. New beginnings. Great. You're out there. You're exploring. You're seeing what's out there. Awesome. New beginnings. You're releasing yourself from the past, the chains that have held you in the past. Just jump chains around her wrists. You're taking off the blindfold. And you're saying, yeah, I'm going to see what's out there. I'm not afraid anymore. I'm secure. I'm stable. Everything seems to be going well. The Wheel of Fortune. Everything's fine. And then along comes Harry McClary. And messes it all up. This is like a... Some light. It's getting a bit dark in here. Oh, it's, that's not quite good enough, is it? It'll have to do. Sorry, guys. I'm, 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 in, I'm on a roll. I can't just get up into the light. So, what's coming in the near future? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is the low blow that's coming. This is somebody who's not available. Somebody who's very detached emotionally. They're not emotionally available for sure. Why is the fool here? You're you're in this you're in this energy that's that's like I want to see what's out there. I want to. I want to. I want to get out there. I want to see what's out there. What's out there is this detached idiot who's coming in, who's avoidant, who isn't available emotionally, and you're here like, yeah, I've been hurt in the past, but I'm good. Let me type in my, and the light will stay on. There we go. <clears throat> they're they're completely unavailable to you this is what comes along and you're in that sort of nice you, you've done the healing you need to do you're an independent person now you're good let's explore oh great the universe just you know just wants to make sure they're bringing someone into your panorama who is actually not available. Not just emotionally available, but they're with somebody else. They have somebody else. But they were no good lying, cheating, scumbag. And the universe is like, are you, are you good? Have, are, are you really Nine of Pentacles? Is this, are, are you really healed as much as you need to? Yes. Yes, you are. I see this, Aries. I see this. But the universe needs to test that. Like it's tested me today. It hasn't sent someone my way, but it's like, are you, are you really, you, you, you really good? Are you really letting go of your twin flame? No, 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 no. Yes, I am actually. Actually, I'm, I'm good. And you are good you're in a good place the universe doesn't need to test you i'm with you here they don't need to send this idiot your way it doesn't need to send this idiot your way it's sending it your way to see if you like dodge the bullet are you gonna are you gonna let the narcissist in because that's what this person is. They're in a relationship, but they want more. They want to... It's about the chase for them. It's, it's about the hunt. They want to know they can get you. And once they've got you, 
they're gonna cast you aside like you're nothing. Drop you like a hot potato. Best you can hope for. You're not gonna fall for it. It's a low blow from the universe, for sure, because it doesn't need to go here. But you're like, no, 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 no. I'm Ten of Pentacles. I'm good, thanks. I'm stable and secure on my own. I got my own money, I got my own house, I got my own emotional security. I don't need somebody to validate anything for me. This is you. You're good. No, you're very good. You know why? Because you're like, yeah, no, no, the sun's here. I'm all about happiness. You're a low vibrational being. You can't have me. I've got the two of cups in reverse. You're like, we're not meant to be together. This is not a thing. I'm not falling for your crap. I'm not falling for your narcissistic toxic love bombing falling for it you you're like ace of swords in reverse you're like nope nope i'm cutting you out you're gonna try and bring your chaos around me your confusion around me not me cutting you out they're like what this has never happened before. I've, I've never had to push so hard to get somebody. This is weird. I don't, I don't know what to do with this. I'm, I'm confused. I don't think that this person's gonna let you go lightly because they, they get what they want. They, they, they always get what they want. They can't have you though. Low blow universe, low blow. This person, uh, they, they, it's, it's all about the chase. It's all about the hunt for them. And I pity the person they're in a relationship with because this person doesn't know they're, they're with somebody so rotten. I'm going to read the outcome here. Then I'm going to ask about this person for you in the extended. I'm going to ask, how do they really feel about you? You don't need to watch the extended because this person's an idiot. This person feels nothing for anyone but themselves. But if you're curious, come on by. I'm going to ask how they really feel about you. What are their intentions towards you? not to leave the person they're with, I can tell you that much. And some guidance from the universe. Three of Swords in reverse. This is part of your healing path. This is the test from the universe. You know it. You're not going to fall for it. You're Nine of Pentacles. You're good. It's just good to know that the test is coming. And it's not for you. You, if, if you just take your time and you're hesitant and you take a step back whenever you get into a new connection with somebody, if you just let it happen slowly, you'll see things unfold and you'll see them for what they really are. What do you need to release? It's always good. It's always good to figure that out. What's, you know, it's, it's a... Uh, something moony is going on at the moment. Tonight, full moon, new moon, one of them. It's time to release, time to release. Uh, for me, I, uh, I am so tired all of the time at the moment. I am going to release whatever is draining me. 
I need to figure out what's draining me and I need to release it. So that's what I'm focusing on tonight with whatever's going on in the moon. I can't remember right now. I was reading it this morning, but um, and your song of the day. Goodbye. Angie by the Rolling Stones. If you have never heard that song, please listen to it. It's, I'm goosebumping right now, all on my shoulders. It's one of the most beautiful songs ever written. Um, yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And if you want to watch extended, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon. You'll find the video there. Bye.